Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to be telling you about some more LGBT plus Christmas gift ideas, namely these little vinyl figurines from Funko. Hello hello, today I am a reindeer because you voted and now I am this. I'm actually a rainbow reindeer, gotta stay on brand. And I'm sorry you can't see all of my antlers, I'll just have to do the whole video like this. Or like this. Hey everyone. <laughs> so this is the final video of my mini series on LGBT plus Christmas gift ideas. But before I get on with it, make sure you like this video, you subscribe to the channel and you turn on notifications. <laughs> okay, so you all know how important I think it is that children's television and media is inclusive of LGBT plus characters. And it's partly the whole reason why I started this channel, because for a while it seemed it just wasn't happening. But I'm pleased to say that slowly LGBT plus characters are popping up in adorable forms in children's mainstream media. So I want to show you some of these vinyl figurines that Funko very kindly sent me that represent just some of the LGBT plus characters found in popular children's entertainment. Also, I've not had one of these before, so I'm, am I allowed to take it out of the box? I think if it's a collectible item for you and you plan on selling it in the future for like loads of money, then keep it in the box. But I'm not planning on doing that. I know that some of you are gonna be like, no, keep it in the box, but I wanna play with it. Okay, first up is just one, because they have more of the characters from Steven Universe. It's Pearl. Oh, she's so pretty and smart and clever and good at fighting. So Steven Universe is a really progressive show on Cartoon Network about the crystal gems. And I love this show because it has so many queer, fluid and diverse identities that we get to learn about as the show goes on. In particular, we learn how Pearl had special feelings for the crystal gems former leader, Rose Quartz. And now you can get Pearl as a little figure. Adorable. Oh my gosh, now onto one of my favourite cartoons of all time, also from Cartoon Network. I swear Cartoon Network is the home of the most progressive shows around. It's Bubbleine, our favourite immortal couple, also known as Princess Bubblegum and Marceline the Vampire Queen. And not just any version, Minecraft version. These are so cute. Now I love watching and learning about their relationship over the seasons, how they had their difficulties, but eventually worked everything out and spoiler alert. Girl, you phrased that so weird. I might have a concussion. <laughs> Basically got together in the end. I mean, it just melts my heart. So make sure you keep these two together forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever. And here's another little character from Adventure Time. It's Bemo. In this case, blushing Bemo, because they are pink. I'm not entirely sure which episode this is from, so if you know, leave a comment, because Bemo is normally green, gray, blue color, but Funko have captured this little cutie in blushing mode. So, yeah. Now, Bemo doesn't have a strictly assigned gender and self-identifies as both male and female, and this is referenced throughout the show. So it's great to have a little character like Bemo representing gender fluidity. However, Bemo, we need more. We need more characters like you. Just saying. And now moving away from cartoons and into live action, and actually fiction, it's Albus Dumbledore from Harry Potter. That's my impression of a British accent, even though I'm British and I sound nothing like that. Now, do we know if Dumbledore is gay? I mean, it's not blatantly obvious from the books or the films, but JK Rowling herself has stated that she always thought of him as being gay. And she created him, so she would know. There are a few tiny, tiny, tinier than this figurine probably, hints out there to look out for them. But again, we want more. We want more gay magicalness from you, Dumbledore. From you. So yeah, there you are, five LGBT plus inclusive figurines from Funko. I love them so much. I think the great thing about these, like some of the other toys that I've shown you, is that they open up conversation about LGBT plus people. I think if you're a parent or an uncle or aunt or whatever, then it's really important for you to know about these characters and shows because then you can demonstrate that being LGBT is just a part of someone's identity and that it isn't really that big of a deal. It's kind of tricky because on one hand we want the representation but then on the other hand we don't want our sexuality and our identities to be made too much of an example of. It's a fine line. Let me know when you found it. Actually I guess these babies are doing just that. 
they're representing in a very usual, everyday way. And as I already mentioned, there are other LGBT plus characters and figures available through Funko at Funko.com. And that's it for this video and this mini series on LGBT plus inclusive Christmas gift ideas. Did you like it? Let me know in the comment section below. Please like, subscribe, turn on notifications and make sure you have a rainbow filled Christmas and a magical new year. See you later.